Chow Chin Chow, Santo Joe here. Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Sword Surprise Lock. In the last episode, we obtained some Shade Root Carrots. Then Spectria decided to um, pillage the village for, for more carrots. Sadly, we were able to get it to uh, go away with the help of Carrax, and it was not pillaging the village anymore, which is good. That's a good thing. But um, we've also learned about the reins of unity as well. We got a tuft of hair from uh, Car uh, from Spectria, and uh, if we combine that with some flowers that Calorex can grow. Um, we can make the reins of unity, hopefully, with the help of the villagers here. I believe the mayor might know something. Let's go and do. Let's go and talk to him. But we'll go and talk to him in a minute. I need to set a timer. Hey Google, set a twenty-five minute timer. Thank you. You are, as always, very welcome. All right, let's do this. Hello. Hello again, savior of our village. Uh, come to do some more reading. I need a favor. I beg your pardon. You want me to make a set of reins of unity? Well, that presents a problem. My dear great-granddad uh, was... If my dear great-granddad was still around, he'd be able to make a set. But unfortunately, we have no one who knows the tradition in our ways at this point. What's more, I doubt you have a flower. Uh, you'd uh, need to forge the range of unity. But I do have a pet. I do have it. You have a petal from the radiant flower. If so, that would mean the king of uh, Bountiful Harvests has truly... No, no. I dare not hope. If I recall, the, my ancestors made the range of unity by following uh, methods passed down in fairy tales. They were two key materials, a flower and a tuft of hair from the Pokemon. But I'm afraid those old traditions have long faded in my memory. Still, how could I refuse such a favour uh, from such a kind and helpful guest? Materials, if you please. I can't promise this will turn out well, uh, as well as my granddad, uh, as well as my great granddad would have made. But it's time to breathe uh, life back into traditions of this village. Hmm. I'm afraid it has come out uh, well. It hasn't come out well at all. I fancy myself a craft, uh, crafty enough to uh, cr enough sort, but I suppose uh, it would take a craftsman of uh, truly delicate uh, to make such fine reins. Oh, please, do not look. Do not look so downhearted. I'm very sorry. I truly am. Oh, hi, Mr. Mayor. Uh, the hot water in my shower seems to have gone on hot. Hey. Ah, oh, yes, I'm terribly sorry. I shall have a look at it. I will get someone to have a look at it soon enough. Oh. What do we have here, Chief? 
Were you in the middle of something? Uh, the pair of you seem awfully gloomy. Here's what happened. What? Is that all? <laughs> so all you need to do is make some uh, uh, cord. Pass me the materials, FOMO. Alright, I got a petal and a hair. Now, what am I supposed to do with that? Hmm. If I may be so bold, allow me to share a song that survives uh, from legends. Blossom uh, woven round uh, and around. A royal gift in uh, Maine's hair bound. Steady on now, old, steady on now, old bloke. Uh, that singing is a bit much. How, uh, well, that appears that, um, if I don't do for an answer. And it's finished. Have a look. I think this will do. Okay, cool. Peony made a set of range of unity. Nice. Cord that shines when you hold it to the light. The people of ancient times um, made these for the King of Bountiful Harvest to express their gratitude. You are more capable than your face lets on. Those reigns of unity are the spitting image uh, of uh, the family tales. <laughs> I don't sew all my dears, uh, my rebellious daughter's clothes for nothing, you know. Even my explorer's outfit I gave to you was uh, my handiwork, Chief. In any case, it seems like we've got a pair of reins of unity. Isn't that just smashing? Yes, you saved the day. Would you believe it? I caught myself falling asleep outdoors again. Uh, I was chilled to the bone, so I thought I'd warm myself up with a good hot shower at the base. But the hot water's coming out ice cold. I got an ultra migraine headache. Human child. You were able to make a set of reins of unity, were you not? You bet I was. Oh joy, what glorious news. I have uh, good news of my own too. I was able to track down the location of my royal steed. Spectria is uh, making his home at the Crown Shine. It is the place where my loyal steed and I spent uh, much time together. I have been avoiding that place, as I feared I would be get trapped in my own nostalgia. Why my loyal steed makes uh, the shine uh, in its home, the shrine its home, is uh, it uh, reminiscing about our time together? No, it can't be. The crown shine stands uh, atop of a majestic mountain to the north. 
bring the carrot and the reins of unity and meet me there. I shall hasten uh, there now, but you uh, may go and you feel ready. I am counting on you, child. Okay, cool. Then I will hasten there too. And uh, where do we need to go? Okay, that's where we need to go. Hopefully I can get there without too much trouble. I mean, there's a weavile there. There's a giant's bed. And the stone temple, which we'll deal with eventually, because I still don't remember how to deal with that. Oh, that just takes me back to the village. I guess we go further onwards. There's an Aerodactyl about. And then we go further onwards again. Down there leads to the uh, Shade Root Forest in the Old Cemetery. And across here must lead to the uh, to this uh, snow side sloop. And then over here must be the ice root forest area. Yep, that would be where you plant ice root, uh, ice root forest, uh, ice root carrots. And, okay. Oh, I'm Junior. I, think I, was, I thought I was going to run into Beldum. Oh, come on, Mime Junior. I don't think I can hit you, but yeah, I really don't think I'm hitting you is a good idea. Because you're a mime junior. What do I do in this situation? Because I can't hit you, because hitting you would kill you. Because you're a mime junior. Is there any way I can weaken you without killing you? No, I really don't think weakening you is a good idea. Because I have all these powerful moves.
So I'm just going to have to go, keep throwing poker balls and hope for the best. There we go. We need to uh, catch the insects and use this Pokemon. It's a wonder trade. That's why I thought I was going to run into. But I didn't. I'm glad. I can just find Beldum's vials anyway. But it's okay, because we can get ourselves up this mountain. Cave back here. Tunnel to the top. And get ourselves another encounter here. Back on. One, two. Lantern Jab. Come on. Two, three, yay, lockdown, nice. I'm Cycler Fable. I did not mean to run into you. I will let you go in peace. And not in pieces. Which would happen if I hit you. For the Mime Junior, we are going to get a Slowpoke. Okay. Do I already not have a Slowpoke? 
I do. I do already have a slowpoke. Then this gets retraded. Because we already have Fleek one. Okay. Then we will retrade. And we will continue to see what we get from the trade. I don't remember how we uh, get to the tunnel on the top. We must be getting close because, you know, wild solomonses don't just appear out of nowhere. Tier 83 ally switch. Okay, maybe not. I was fooled. by my abilities to summon po very strong Pokemon. Let's see if going up here does anything. Oh, trade complete. Round two. I think I already have a Bastion. And since I'm only able to make Bastion Legion, this also keeps on trading. Yeah, I have a red one. I have Sega. So we will retrade. Path to the peak. Ah, this is where we need to be. Catch a frost moth. Okay. Do damage. I can, cool. Okay, Blizzard doesn't miss in a hail, that's how it works. Two, three, yay! Ah, 
that trade complete. Here we go again. Round three. Sneasel, we don't have one of these. I don't think so, anyway. I think I've caught one in the past, but I don't have one of them right now. I don't have one in the box, in my dead box either. So yeah, this is, as far as I can tell, this is legal. That's timer. Stop. And that means we will continue on trading and uh, getting on our way to the path to the, uh, to the peak in the next episode. But for the moment in time, I must stop because that's what a timer means. We will continue on in the next episode. But until next time, I am Lantern Joe. You have been watching another episode of the Pokemon. Sword Surprise Lock. And until next time, I am Lantern Joe, and I will see you next time. In but until then, mingle the Pokemon get to us. Everybody get Pokemon. Good night. Thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, then please consider leaving a like, comment, and subscribing for more videos. And of course, if you ring the bell, you'll be notified first when those videos come out. You can follow me on Twitter at Lantern Joe, where you'll get news, thoughts, and opinions from me and the rest of the Lantern Nation. And of course, if you want to watch some more videos, there should be something in the top right and top left hand corner of this here end card. But until next time, I have been Lantern Joe, and I'll see you on the next video.